So the classic private prison horror story is this, and it sounds terrible. You pay a prison per prisoner per day. And so the prison cuts back on training, on staffing, on, on everything they can, on food quality, to try to get some sort of margin on each prisoner. Right? And then they take those margins and they pull them out of the prison and use it for their own private ends. And then they campaign hard to maintain prisoner count and fight reform because every body in their prison is cash. In fact, having bad training and rehabilitation works in their favor because everyone who comes back is more cash, right? I agree, this is horrible. But what I've just described is the entirely public contract system in Louisiana, right? The state facing capacity constraints enter into contracts with local public sheriffs to house state inmates in public jails. And the sheriffs did this exactly as I said. They undercut spending. They took that money to spend on their own department outside the prison. It is the classic private prison horror story. But when it started, it was entirely public. Now, the privates came in later to help them build out the jails as sort of these collateral sort of groups that latched on. But the failure was entirely public, entirely about incentives. And so you could create private prisons with different incentive contracts. Maybe they work better, right? So Australia is actually trying this. They've created a prison in Australia run by Sodexo. Um, where the payment is tied to recidivism, not to capacity, right? So if these people don't come back, you start getting paid more. Uh, and Pennsylvania just did that with their halfway houses. Uh, they terminated all their contracts. Now they have a, sort of a recidivism incentive compliance term in their contracts. Um, so I think we focus on the wrong things. The public sector unions are far more powerful, get far more money, have all the same problems. And really it's about incentives, right? And that we gave privates better incentives, they would act better. And we give publics terrible incentives, they'll act just like the privates. <laughs>